What is up guys? Alex from Blakey War Games here and welcome to today's video. Today is more of a sort of a channel update, sort of slash new schedule, filling in and painting challenge update, kind of all in one. Um, I realise it's been a while since I've posted anything on the channel in video format and I do apologise for that. It's been one of those kind of uh, crazy stories, you know, that you always hear, you know, a, a moved house sort of just as I was starting to post stuff again. It always happens. Every time I try and reboot the channel, I end, always end up moving. Um, so I sort of had everything. I was just settling in as I started to upload stuff. Um, and then the kind of whole crazy everything that comes with it. So, you know, retraveling from work, like seeing people going places, kind of just generally being in a new area and finding everything new kind of kicked in straight away after that, which kind of takes time out of just being able to, you know, be in a routine and just, you know, do things as you were the way you want to do them. Um, work picked up, as work always gets in the way. Work hates hobby, as everybody knows. Um, so, I mean, there was work going on as well. Um, my girlfriend finished her uni course, which is great. And um, congratulations again to her if she's listening. And she did fantastic to Flying Colours to pass her uni course. And she's also started her own craft business, um, Simply Meant to Be Crafts, um, which is amazing. And I've been helping her try and, you know, get that up and running and out there. And she's doing a fantastic job running that. Um, if anyone's interested in sort of that, it's sort of like handmade crafts and jewellery. Um, she does it all herself. She works really hard doing that. She's working as well, so she does that in her spare time, um, which is why I try and help her every now and then to, uh, you know, kind of take some of that pressure away. Um, but she's doing fantastic with that. So that kind of, you know, takes up a little bit of, little bit of my time trying to help her with that. Um, and that kind of, you know, everything like that all snowballed into one. Um, but I feel like I'm finally in a nice collective place where I can just, I'm, I'm now, everything's where I need it to be and I've settled. And like I mentioned before, when you kind of haven't got that routine of, right, wake up, go to work, do this, come home, I've got time for this, then do this, you know, kind of, I feel like I'm in a better place to do routine. Um, and for my hobby, my hobby time, I like, it's not that I didn't have time to make videos. I, I'm not going to sit here and say that's all in a big excuse. And, you know, there was, there was plenty of time to make videos. Um, but, but the videos kind of come out of my personal hobby time. And I, I, in a way, almost had to take a step back and just enjoy the hobby, you know, for what it was. Sort of not put that pressure on myself to feel like I'm forced to put the content out. And then kind of, you know, drive it downhill because it's not how I wanted it to be. Um, so I've still been playing games, painting models, taking part in a few like painting competitions and everything like that, like local low-key ones. Um, part of the thing of moving to a new area was finding some new gaming clubs and the existing ones that I go to, um, the travel, because I don't currently drive, um, I've been having to get like the train and the bus and you know certain places or lifts with people. So going to my existing gaming clubs have been a bit more difficult. So I found a few new ones, been attending a few gaming nights and just kind of, you know, relaxing and enjoying enjoying the hobby for what it was before, you know, I had the idea to start this. And it's been it's been great. And um yeah, if any of you guys follow me on social media, um or if you're not aware, I do have a Facebook page um and also an Instagram page that I post on quite regularly so I'll leave the links for those below as well for anyone who's interested because even when I'm not posting stuff up um, I'm constantly putting things like work in progresses little sneak peeks things that you don't see here on YouTube all go up on there um, sometimes it's more of a glimpse into like my personal life like if I've gone away on holiday or anything then you know I'm still putting things out there still relating and you can keep up to date with everything that will be on there um, so there's still I've still been posting a lot of stuff on there which I think is also been a bit confusing for a few people that do follow me on here and on the social media side of it because it's kind of like I haven't really taken I put an explanation up on Facebook but I mean I didn't really take the time out to explain you know all these different things are going on um so it kind of looks almost like I've neglected the YouTube a little bit um which in truth I mean I kind of have I mean I think it's like th three months now since I've uploaded something something crazy like that like that's just an insane amount of time and I do apologize from the bottom of my heart about that um, it's not that I haven't wanted to do things it's just I don't want to put content out that's not to the level of you know that benchmark that I want to set myself and make sure everything's consistent and good and the content's not just content for the sake of getting it out there um, 
so yeah but with that that said um today is the first first of uh first of august and we've got some great new news because i've you know that i was going to start this last week but i thought hey i'll just wait for the start of the new month and we'll roll it out um it's also you know it's a thursday today um but I've got a new schedule coming up, which some of you, if you're on the Facebook page, you saw a sneak peeky of, um, and I'm going to be uploading at least two times a week from now on, um, and they're going to be on the Tuesdays. We're going to have what's called Tactical Tuesday, and that is a new weekly video um, that has sort of specific game systems or an army or a unit in the style of the tactics videos that are currently like the Night Haunt ones that are up on the um, YouTube channel, and to start with, it probably will just be night haunts on the tactical tuesdays um but that could be anything from say like top five units in this army um you know sort of aggressive versus passive play sort of you know any kind of tactical element um to do with tabletop wargaming will always be on the tuesday um, i'm also going to be posting every week on a friday um, something that i'm going to call free fridays um, and fridays like I said, will be a weekly upload, but there's no set scheme or sort of theme to that day. Um, it may be another sort of tactics video following on from the Tuesday or just another one. Um, it may be like a video like this one where it's more of a channel update or I'm announcing a new series. Um, it'll basically be sort of any video that I've had time to create in that week, but there will be a video on the Friday. Um, so some weeks it may be the tactics video on a Tuesday and a Friday. It might be a tactics Tuesday tactics video on the Tuesday then like a channel update on the Friday but there will be two uploads a week on the Tuesday and the Friday um, and there'll also be I'm thinking it'll probably be a more of a fortnightly thing but I'm planning on probably Sundays I think would be a nice day because then there's a few days between each each day to get something done um, but it'd be more of a fortnightly so every other week um, and that'll be more of a, a physical hobby based thing so like the tactics things are quite a a verbal thing something like this where you can listen to it you know you can do your hobby this is playing on in the background and you can listen to it um, but this will be more of a something you can sit down and watch so it'll be like painting tutorials or let's builds or sort of hobby tips and tricks that kind of thing um but i'm going to keep that as like a fortnightly sort of thing at the moment because i don't want to just go straight up i'd love to be able to do three uploads a week um but i don't want to you know promise three uploads and then miss them so we're definitely going to have the two we're going to have the tuesdays and the fridays um, and then we're going to start off with every other sunday and we're going to see what goes on from there um the last thing i wanted to sort of keep up on with this um was the nick's new year painting challenge that i started um that I put a video out, I put part one, it was going to paint my Blades of Corn, the first thousand points, the Gore Pilgrims list. Um, since then, unfortunately, I did get some more of that painted, but I've sold that corn army now. I've sold all my Blades of Corn um, to a friend of a friend that was just starting out in Age of Sigmar. But with the money that I made from selling that army, I've brought myself, um, I'll put a picture of it, I've brought 2,000 points of Soul Blight with the money that I made from that. Um, which is something I just felt a bit more passionate about. Um, the Soul Blight also, because it's all in the Death Grand Alliance, fits very well with my Night Haunt army, so I can mix and match things. Like at the moment, I've got 20 Blade Geist Revenants in my Soul Blight army, um, which is awesome. I love those models. Um, so it kind of it felt a bit more of the right thing to do for me because I wasn't as much as I do love the Corn Range and I do love the playstyle and things. Um, I just felt like this was a better move for me. So it was great because it managed to get a friend of a friend into the hobby. He's got an amazing starting point. Um, but unfortunately, that means that that's no longer <laughs> my painting challenge um, target. So I was going to do my Vampire Lord, who was allied into my Night Haunt. Um, he's also in my Soul Blight army. And I started doing a thing. If you do follow me on the Instagram, I started doing sort of work in progress things and I was going to make a video sort of yeah this is going to be my new target I give myself two weeks and I'll paint him up and amazingly I managed to get him finished in like five days or something like that something crazy a um, couple of hours a night five days five five six days something like that less than a week and I finished him and I thought wow I was like I've never painted a model to that you know that that quick <laughs> so I was quite surprised at myself and I didn't get a chance to um do a sort of a update thing um but yeah if you trail back on the instagram i mean it's all on there the work in progress pictures so you can see him come to life um so what i've done instead is the picture that's up on the screen of the um 
2,000 points of Soul Blight. I'm going to challenge myself to get them finished. Um, the Bleed Geist Revenants and the actual Vampire Lords on the Dragons. Um, there's two Dragons in there. Um, and then there's also 15 Blood Knights. I, the Blood Knights and the Revenants and the Vampire Lords themselves don't really phase me too much. But the Dragons are pretty intimidating, um, if I'm honest. I'm just looking at them now. They're sat on my desk. <laughs> um, so I, I, I kind of want to try and get it finished by... I mean, it's the first today, so I mean, if I could finish them by the end of the month, that would be fantastic. Um, but I don't know if I can paint both those dragons in that time. If it was one dragon, maybe. But I don't know about the two. So, um, yeah, so that's going to be my painting challenge between now and... I'll try and get it done two months max, we'll say. So it's, it's the 1st of August today, um, and we'll try and have that done by... 1st of October, let's say, let's set that as the original deadline. Um, and yeah, I'll make a separate video, you know, kind of like how the part one was, I'll lay it out and, you know, the things like that. Um, but yeah, so apologies to Nick, I'm sorry, I failed my challenge. Um, <laughs> again, I kind of don't have the thing and I didn't make the video for it, um, so I'm going to replace that with that. And uh, yeah, that's it, so we're going to go, we're going to swap over from now on to the new two, two weekly uploads every week. Um, and then alternating Sundays, uh, it probably won't be, if it's not this Sunday, then it will be the Sunday after that, and whichever Sunday I pick, it will be then every other Sunday from then on, uh, but you can look forward now to two uploads a week. Um, again, social medias, feel free to follow those, I'm on Facebook and Instagram, um, that's where all the behind the scenes is, and you can drop me direct messages and anything like that, um, any questions or anything, I'm more than welcome, always happy to answer those, always available. And uh, yeah, thank you very much to everyone who's found the channel, still getting comments. Um, and I do apologize to everyone who's kind of wondered where I've been. Uh, but hopefully this will be like a little explanation on, you know, kind of where what, what's happened and what's going to happen. And, you know, a nice little summary and wrap up. And uh, yeah, I'm very excited. I'm very excited now to get the ball rolling and just, you know, just go, just go, go, go on all hobby fronts and get it out there and make some good quality content for you guys so thank you very much for sticking around i hope you guys enjoy the ride um any comments or sort of ideas or anything anything that you'd like to see on the channel please feel free to leave them in a comment below i read all the comments i love hearing from you guys and you know because it's you guys at the end of the day that's got to put up with me <laughs> making these videos so i'd like to make them in a way that's enjoyable for all of you and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and happy wargaming.